Okay, so some of you probably seen some of my videos on my components or electronics that I've been buying as far as cabling, cutoff switches, even my tool uh, truck toolbox that I painted digital camel, which came out pretty cool. Right now it's all dusty and it's hanging in there. So, oh. so I've been camping since Friday and it's already Sunday and I haven't ran out of power. I don't own a generator and I've been able to run everything nonstop except for the AC. So I'm gonna show you my setup. So I got my four batteries here. It's a little bit of mess. I still gotta do wire management in this thing. So this, I just, I gotta readjust it, but it's just to hold my batteries from bouncing around, but it's really not even needed. So here I got a cutoff switch. Here I got a fuse. I got a breaker here and uh, also another cutoff switch. And what I'm doing is I'm plugging this thing right into a pigtail that I got coming out. And it's the main power for this whole trailer. So there you go, there goes my toolbox setup, battery setup. So another thing is this thing, I probably got about 500 pounds put onto this bumper. And on my previous video, I talked about the safety struts. So here's the safety strut. So this actually reinforced it really good. It's not going anywhere. I can push down as hard as I want on it. It is not going anywhere. And I also put bolts. There's a steel plate and I angled, I guess a steel angled piece. And then I also have a galvanized plate on top. So it's pretty sturdy as you can see. It does have a little rock to it, but that's the shape of the toolbox. This thing isn't going anywhere. So if you look at it from a side view, it looks like it's just hanging off the bumper, but it's not going anywhere. Okay, so there goes a the video about my batteries and how I got it hooked up to power.